Let's get started. We want a full hour of music here with the Never Ever Band. Uh, Tom Geddes is on vacation, so he asked me to uh, step in. And uh, when he asked me to do it, I looked. He said September, uh, whatever today is, 15th, whatever, 14th. And he said, oh, 14th, who's playing? And I saw Never Ever Band. I'm going, man, I hit the jackpot, right? So not only are they they're good friends and great musicians, I think you're going to enjoy it, too. Let's give a hand for the Never Ever Band. Okay, we're going to start off with Swami in Disguise. Okay.
Okay, the songs we're performing today are mostly penned by the ladies here. And uh, this is one that I got a chance to come up with several words with and phrasings. And not being a musician, I couldn't come up with a decent melody line for them. So I handed it off to them. And they put in a Cuisinart. And this is what we came up with. I think this was this one is of the, what, our first songs? Really, once, yeah. Um, this is a song about my daughter's first trip out into the world, really away. She had been involved in blues dancing and went up to a seminar in Washington State. And uh, on the reservoir there, they built a floating dance floor and danced through the night on the water. And that's the name of this song. When she 
Okay, Gil. Okay. We're going to take you to the beach. I don't know about you, but the first thing I like to do is lay down in the hot sand and bury my toes and look at the ocean until I'm bored, which I never seem to get to. So, this is called Toes and Sand.
for my younger sister. She passed a year ago, and, and uh, I remember when she was really struggling with her illness. I was sitting there, and this song came to me so easily. It's just now that I've gotten over crying whenever I play it. <laughs> okay, here we go. It's not sad. No, it's not sad. It's about hope.
So we we go down on Thursday night to Reality Kitchen over on River Road. Where uh, hosted and instigated a bunch of rabble rousers who come in and, <laughs> and play. It's a wonderful place to be. Yeah. And he threw out a challenge a while back. Carl. 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 Yeah. That guy over there. <laughs> it's his fault. Okay, take, take this well-known song and change it and add it to something. And Chris said, well, you know, I have this song that would seem to live with it pretty good. And it did. So this yeah, is Yeah, I just started talking. writing this with Kathy, and, and it seemed to just go together nicely. And, uh, <laughs> And I go, how many royal kids am I going to have to pay? <laughs> <laughs> I hear you have a family yet. Uh, <laughs> Even now, there's a family that owns this. I think it's 135 a year. You'll know the song. Yeah, here we go. <laughs>
Except they have these songs that are just absolutely drop dead gorgeous. So Chris and I just took one note, well, one song, and wrote some words to it. So there we go.
Yeah. Good. This song is sort of like the antithesis, is that the right The yin and the yang. The yin and the yang to the song about drinking too much. So, this is the guy story. At least. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. Okay. Okay. When the thought is in your head and you're in someone else's bed, do you remember what you said the night before? You might think that it's okay, you didn't love her anyway. Well, let your heart get in the way, you know you lied. Before she wakes, you better run. Just like a vampire from the sun. The light of day is a smoking gun. Don't have to pay. You can run, but you can't hide. You can run, but you can't hide. You can run, but you can't hide. Gonna wrap up all my troubles, throw them here. 
Okay.